I'm on day 17. I don't know the rest of the words of that song, though, so. Welcome back, everybody. Day 17 of deck time. We got Squaddle. We got a Freaky Fish Guy. Let's get to the cards. The penultimate Freaky Fish Guy pack. What will I get? Who knows? I Probably some fish. I peaked. I'm excited for this one. It's gonna be obvious if you know me. I'll make it the last one. Sorry for ruining the, su the uh, surprise. <clears throat> anyway, I'm serious. No one will know. We got Rank Up Magic, the seventh one. Bahamut Shark. Number 71, Rebarian Shark. Buzzsaw Shark. And the one and only Frostosaurus. <laughs> oh, I love it. Oh, the legends. Look at that. Ugly rarity. That common. Oh, it's beautiful. I'm sorry, you sharks. I can't use extra decks, so no to either of these sharks. To keep with the theme of not picking sharks. And I'm not even going to read this. Because Frostosaurus is amazing. Oh, it is a normal monster, so I will read its flavor text, I guess, instead of its effect. <laughs> This monster's metabolism enables it to endure long periods of cold, harnessing the power to become a creature of solid ice. Nothing else can withstand such temperatures, especially victims of its glacial rampage. Frostosaurus, baby. Oh, it's beautiful. You bring good luck, Squaddle. I love it, I love it, I love it, I love it. It's good. It's good juju. <laughs> Sorry for a less than suspenseful episode of Deck Time, but don't worry, we got a few more days of potential suspense. So I will see you tomorrow. Mwah! Back uh, in the height of making fake Yu-Gi-Oh cards with pictures of your friends, I decided to make my brother one. And the effect of it was when you summoned the suave snow magician, I think, uh, you could special summon up to three Frostosaurus to your side of the field which would be absolutely broken, but we didn't really care too much about game balance when we were making those cards. 